sometimes I think about the fact that my wife Chelsea and I have been married for 20 years. And we met on the set of Growing Pains. She played Mike Seaver's girlfriend. Mike had phenomenal taste in women. And I know being married for 20 years in Hollywood is, is something of a miracle. I think the thing that has made it work for my wife and I is to understand that our marriage is, is really something that fits into the much bigger picture of God's love for his bride, the church. Uh, if you go back into the Garden of Eden, you see God creating a man. Uh, his name is Adam. His side, his rib is removed and Eve is created. And then God takes the two and puts them back together as one. And then God gives them the commission to be fruitful and multiply, have lots and lots of babies and fill the earth, take dominion over God's creation and subdue all things for the blessing and glory of God. What an amazing charge. The assignment to Adam and Eve, to husband and wife, was to go change the world. Take the pattern I've given you here in Eden, push out the boundaries until the knowledge and glory of God covers the whole land like the waters cover the sea. Now that assignment, amazingly, was not given to an army or to uh, a government. It was given to a couple, to a family. Changing the world happens primarily through families. And so while Hollywood does much to undermine marriage, it's been the very thing that's kept our marriage together, is that we understand God brought us together and that we need to stay together and love one another, even when it's difficult, because that sends a message to the rest of the world that there is a God who loves us, even when we don't deserve it. And without our faith in Christ, I don't think our marriage would have lasted in Hollywood. Find more at moments.org.